The deadline has come and gone for anyone wanting to run for public office in the May primary. Nomination petitions had to be turned in to the Erie County Election Office by 4.30 this afternoon, and candidates are telling us their next steps. Brianna Malone joins us from the newsroom with more. Brianna. Jen, candidates say they are excited to continue their civic duty and serve the Erie community if elected. Nomination petitions for the 2023 May primary election were due at 4 p.m. and the election director says as the clock winds down, they anticipated more drop-offs. We expect to be very busy today. We're expecting to get around 200 candidates. Right now we have about 130. She says the office has been staffed to help candidates throughout the entire process by reminding them to double check dates on the petition, bring the necessary documents to the election office, and file a statement of financial interest. One candidate that is running for a four-year term with City Council says being elected would continue her service in the Erie community. It's just something like I feel is a civic duty. Um, voting is good, getting involved in your community is good, but going that one step further is, is always a good thing to do. Another candidate is running in hopes of retaining her position within the county. I love this job. It's very important to me and I've really appreciated everyone's support and encouragement and we've just been out getting signatures, a lot of friends and family helping out with that. Now that petitions are filed, candidates say their next step leading up to the primary is going door to door to hear concerns from the residents. In the usual, just going to be hitting the doors, talking to my neighbors, talking to residents in the city, um, trying to find common ground and find out what their concerns are and, and how I can be effective in, in helping them address those concerns. Community engagement is very important to me. It's been something I've been striving for even just this past year. So the opportunity to continue to do that, it's been really exciting to be able to go to door to door to meet people, so I will absolutely continue to do that. And hers also thanks the Erie County Election Office for being helpful and patient during the drop-off process.